Oh my gosh. It's to the point. There's no frills. <laughs> Clearly. Just the good stuff. So you're gonna make a Twinkie drink? I wanna make a Twinkie drink, which I'm very excited about. I'm going to use both the sponge cake, which is so fluffy and nice, and the cream filling to do Twinkies two ways. I'm going to take the sponge cake and infuse it in Jameson, and I'm going to make a Collins, which is liquor, citrus, sugar, and soda. And then I'm gonna take the Twinkies cream filling and add peach nectar and soy lecithin to create a cocktail air that goes on top. It's gonna be a cream soda type yeah. drink with a little something on top. Woo! It's gonna I am so, I'm genuinely so excited. I really think this is gonna be amazing. I believe you. And we'll probably get somebody from the watcher staff to come over and taste it because I'm an unreliable narrator. And let's get started. Are you ready? Before we get started, a word from our sponsor. Hey, I gotta eat. You gotta eat, we all gotta eat. But what do you eat? After you've crawled home, your body wrung dry by the unrelenting clutches of capitalism, what do you eat? I'll tell you what you eat, so you never have to think about what to eat ever again. Factor, baby. Factor is a food delivery service now owned by HelloFresh that delivers fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals right to your door and into your old belly. Factor meal plans range from four to 18 meals per week. So if you're like me and you don't want to dedicate a single brain cell to your food, hey, you don't have to. Factor lets you easily skip or customize meals to suit your preferences. You can also add on proteins, juices, energy bites, sides of veggies, desserts, all developed by registered dietitians, so you know you're really getting that bang for your buck. And, oh, it's good. Oh boy, is it tasty. Watch me eat this. I'm gonna eat one right now. It's time to eat. I keep a fork in my pocket at all times. Right now I've got some Herb crusted chicken to enjoy. What do we have over here? Ooh, those look like some tasty little green beans. Mmm. I'm gonna have a little bite of this. Oh my god. It's juicy. Oh, hello. This is actually very good. That is delicious. I have some green beans to top it off here. A little pieces of garlic in them. Mmm. That's good. I don't even have to have lunch today because I'm having lunch right now. Mmm. Uh, oh, you're right. Seriously, a factor has been a great way for me to stay on top of my meals and make sure I'm actually eating something balanced. So head over to factor75.com or click the link below and use the code watcher40 to get 40% off your first factor box. Again, that's factor75.com and click the little link below for a whopping 40% off your first box. Go, go now. Just try some of this. You're gonna, you're gonna love it. Anyway, back to the show. I put on gloves because Twinkies are so greasy. 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 You can see the grease on the packaging, and I'm a clean bartender. So. He's a clean bitch. I'm a clean bitch. What we're gonna do is we're gonna scrape the cream into this jar that we're gonna make the air with. And it's okay if a little sponge cake gets in, but basically we're gonna separate the two. So that's what a Twinkies is. It's a sponge cake. Sponge cake with and like cream filling. Mystery cream. This is a little tedious. There is no right way to do this. Have you done this one before? I have practiced this at home before. So okay. I have torn apart a Twinkies. Why do we need so many Twinkies? Why can't we just get a little bit of like the taste? Why do we need eight of them? The cream is hard to get out. So if you use one, it wouldn't really be enough. Okay. If you use four, it's like, yeah, there's a hint. Okay. But I want to like oh. be slapped in the face with flavor. I want to be like, <laughs> cream filling. I don't think I'm mature enough for this recipe. We're now going to set the cream filling aside and we are going to soak this in Jameson. Ooh. Yeah, right? I don't know why. Like Jameson is just like, sounds good. It's a like, classy, it's pretty. The yes. bottle, like it feels like very like classic. What am I thinking? Did we start this episode without a shot? Oh my God. This will absolutely get the job done. So I'm gonna do half for me. Oh my God, it's a lot. I'll do like. A little, a little Ricky. No, a more? little more than that. Oh really? Yeah, that's fine. Cheers. Cheers. Bon appetit. Just 
sauce like mom used to make. <laughs> So we're gonna soak the Jameson in here. We're gonna let it marinate, soak up all its goodness, and then we're gonna squeeze it out. What is no, like this a... is a nut milk bag. Very Amish. It's like you let's know, make our own almond milk. We don't take shortcuts here. No. The harder it is, the better. The That's, more Amish, the better. The, the more Amish, the better. Okay, so basically we are going to squeeze out all the sponge cake. Is that, did it soak for enough time to get all the flavor you think? I think it did because normally you let it infuse and it's hard to extract the flavor. Okay, should we try it a sip? I think it, I think it infused. Mmm. The drama of his own creation. No, it infused should so I well. Try, try it? it, yeah. Just like the tiniest sip. Ugh. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, really? Do you, do you taste the sponge cake? No. You're lying. No, I just don't like it. I, like, now I don't like it. Jameson or this just mix? Just this mix? Don't worry. It's bitter. It's really? really Wait, bitter I gotta to try me. again. Ew. No way. Water. I need water. Mmm. <laughs> no, 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 no. Are I love it. What? So we're now gonna dump this Ugh. nut milk bag, which we're gonna set in a mason jar. This is tasty. We should also bottle Ew. this up. So, look how gross it looks now. Does this look gross? It's like funky apple juice. Yeah, no, it's uh, it's got nutrients. Okay. <laughs> so now we're gonna make the cocktail air with Twinkies cream, peach nectar, and our good friend, soy lecithin. What is this? So soy lecithin is an emulsifying agent that chefs and bartenders use hmm. to help foam up something. So have you ever been to those restaurants where it's like there's like an air or foam on top? Yeah. It yeah, probably yeah, uses yeah. soy lecithin. Wow. But the thing is you have to be very exact with this. If you use too much, it collapses the air and it becomes very liquidy. Huh. So this is where it gets super exact. We want to use between 0.5 to 1% of this weight. I'm gonna measure out 200 okay. gram. 130, 70. Yeah, 205. 205 is pretty good. And now, do you wanna do the math? No. We, we wanna do 0. 0.05 of 200. We want 10 grams of soy lecithin. We're gonna add 10 gram of this. Cause you do too much, I swear this turns into water and nothing works. So we're gonna pour this in. Okay. So now we're gonna blend the Twinkies cream, peach nectar, and soy lecithin to create the air. You want this to slowly foam up and we're gonna put this on top of the cocktail. So we'll see how it goes. We'll give it a whirl. We could potentially add more soy lecithin, but I just wanna see how well this goes on top. A little liquidy still. Let me try a, a little, little more. more. A little more. So now I added five more grams of soy lecithin, which now makes it between 0.5 and 1%. So 0.75, which is in the ballpark. So let's give this a whirl. Let me try to turn this on higher. Okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You can see it start to structure. Great, great, great. So the air will hold shape for a little while. Do you want to try it? This is it good? It's kind of great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, I mean, it tastes like ice cream. It tastes like ice cream. It tastes like peaches and cream, but it yeah. tastes like a real peach. No, that's peach. bomb. <gasps> that's bomb. So we're gonna float this on top mm. of the cocktail. So we'll set this aside for now. Woo! I knew this was gonna be good. I'm not surprised. This is so bomb. It's still not over. Should we construct a drink? Yeah, let's do it. The first thing we're gonna need to do is get some lemon juice. We're going to roll our lemon. You wanna roll the lemon or lime um, to get more juice out of it. So more bang for your buck. So then we're going to squeeze our juice and set it aside. We're gonna need one ounce of this. Are you having fun watching the juice? I just like how percent, like I like you're just so like, you just go for it. You know, you gotta, you're just like, you just go for it. You gotta go for it, otherwise no one else will. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you gotta make You gotta this go cocktail. for it. You gotta go for it. Oh, can we have ah! ice? 
Oh, we need ice. I think we're ready to Yay, I'm foam excited. up this bad boy. So we're gonna be creating a classic Collins type cocktail, which is your base spirit, citrus, sugar, and soda. Ooh. It's a fantastic combo. Mm. But we're doing things a little bit differently. We have our sponge cake infused Jameson as our spirit. We're adding two ounces here. And then we're adding equal parts, one ounce, fresh squeezed lemon juice, simple syrup, and I'm adding one more secret ingredient in here. I'm going to be adding a couple dashes of saline solution. This is essentially salt water, and it basically changes the dynamic of a drink. Think of margarita when you have a lick of salt before you drink it, it's different. It's not necessarily better or worse, but it adds a different dynamic that I wanted to add to this cocktail. So we're just gonna add a little, a couple dashes, and then I think we're ready to give this a shake. Oh, that's a pretty glass. So. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> So normally you want to fill this in a Collins glass with ice, but I'm going for something a little bit different. I'm going to be pouring this in a rocks glass. I think with the air, it has a nice look to it. Now a classic Collins, you top off with carbonation, the soda water on top, and it's just like a nice, elegant drink. You're supposed to strain this over ice in a Collins glass, but I wanted the look of a clean drink. I want to let the foam take center stage. So we're gonna do that. Typically you wanna fill up the glass with soda water, but I really want to bring the nostalgia of cream soda. Yeah. This drink is a peaches and cream drink, so I am going to add a cream soda. Full. I like that this drink feels more approachable. Yes. Like anyone could make this drink if this isn't like. We're not enough. doing anything crazy here, right. minus the, the soy straining. lecithin. And like the, the, the milk bag situation is, you know, it was a little, not your everyday, you know? Yeah, exactly. But everything else some, is pretty Some pretty technique, doable. but yeah, a very approach, you're right, it's a very approachable drink. So this has a natural foam uh, to it, but now we're gonna add our peach foam, which I'm very excited about. Cocktail foam, almost like a butter beer. Oh, okay. You know? Okay. Yeah, this is the grown this up butter beer. This is the grown beer. up version. Uh, the last thing I'm gonna do is zest some lime over it, just so you get some citrus on the nose, because I think it balances out the sweet, and it adds a nice visual effect. So you're gonna take it over your microplane, and garnish, and this. Wow! Amazing. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, just so we know, I don't like alcohol, so I just want right. to preface that. I don't, you know, but I, you know. Ricky Wang. Really? Ricky Wang. Wait, I have No, wait, really? Ricky Wang. This is amazing. Yo! Yo! Wow. Oh my god. It makes you want to get like drunk. Salivating. Me I'm too. Like, this is so. Yo. I think it's well balanced. Oh, I was thinking it would be a winter drink. This is not winter, actually. Oh, this is giving yeah, me more yeah, yeah, summer. Yeah. Like there's like a peaches and cream. Like yes. Free yes. in the air. It's summer. It's like in North Carolina. Are we running? Is You're on summer like, vacation. Yeah, we're on summer vacation. Okay, Brittany. Brittany, come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Brittany is the ultimate <laughs> tester. Oh my god, okay. Yeah. Please. I'm really nervous. <laughs> oh, it's I'm so nervous. good. Oh, it's so pretty. Yeah. yeah. Feel free to take a like get the nose yeah. for the citrus. Mm, um, I get the citrus. Okay, okay I'll, let me, I'll just go for it. Toot in your own horn. Wow, this is delightful. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh, no, right? Yeah, 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 it keeps yeah, yeah. going, it keeps layers. going. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know. Mm. I know, no. It, mm. There are layers to this. Yeah, right? No, first is really citrusy, really light, and then the peach cream kicks in. Yes, the peach. Perfect. So North good. Carolina approved. North Carolina. Yes, I'm from North Carolina. Would you order this at a bar? 100%. Yeah. I Me can, too. I can taste the the effort, like the sincerity and like the effort that goes into it. And I'm like, wow, I would 
pay money. Okay, mm. what's our price point? Uh, you know, I want this to be approachable for everyone. I, I, I say twelve dollars. Oh, I say oh. fourteen. I was gonna say fifteen. Fifteen. <laughs> it's settled. Fifteen. But I like twelve. I like twelve because oh. then it invites people to you know drink yeah, it. Yeah, to try it. Yeah. This is you guys the layers. Insane. I'm Ricky. very happy with this. I'm so they, proud they, of thank you. Thank you. We did it. We did it, Joe. We, oh yeah, we, we did it. We did it, Joe. I wasn't as nervous as the others because I knew that peaches would work with the cream, whatever. But I was so nervous about the technique and how it would come together. You always say this. We don't need to worry. Oh, no, oh, no. Right. Sometimes yeah. we do need to worry. I am worried. <laughs> no, I'm. I was worried. But about I'm so happy. No, this was amazing. This one I will absolutely be making yeah. again. This for me. is like for me. Me too. Yeah. Honestly, <laughs> favorite drink you've ever made for me ever ever. ever. Really? Yeah. In all oh the years. Oh my god. The, yeah, for sure. Like. I'm sad Ryan's on here. Like he would freak oh, out. Oh, Ryan would freak out. He'd this. freak out. Ricky, this is so good. Thank you, Brittany. Thank I you, trust Brittany. Brittany. I'm gonna just like steal this over. I, I know. <laughs> Thank when, we, you. when we cut, when we cut. Oh yes, I. <laughs> Thank you for supporting me through this journey. Oh my God! Thank you for making me the best cocktail I've ever had, ever. Ever. Wait, you that nailed is it. a lot. Thank I, you. Yeah. Thank you for joining us on Worth a Shot. And come on. Let, like, come on. She's beauty and she's oh. grace. You are so sweet. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Try this at home. Yes. All you need is a nut milk bag. <laughs> see you guys next episode. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.